why the heck do we even have daylight saving time? We spring forward in the spring, we fall back in the fall. So what gives? What's it all about? Well, I thought I could take you through a little bit of history of daylight saving time. A lot of people believe that this guy, Benjamin Franklin, was the creator of daylight saving time. That's actually not true, but it is a little interesting. So back in the day, Benjamin Franklin's day, he actually lived in France for a time and he tended to make fun of the French people. They were a little lazy and they waited until after sunrise to wake up. Benjamin Franklin proposed an idea that during sunlight, if you set the clocks back an hour, you wouldn't actually have to worry too much about lighting candles and people would wake up earlier. Again, it was pretty Pretty much a joke, but this joke kind of got people's minds turning and in the early 1900s when people really relied on coal and wood fire for energy, people started to think a little bit more about this. If they were up during the daylight, they wouldn't have to use as much coal and as much fire to help with lighting places or keeping things warm. But it wasn't until World War I that a country actually took this seriously. First, Germany initiated daylight saving time, and in order to keep up with the clocks, so did Europe and the United States in World War I. And still to this day, the United States uses daylight saving time. It's actually entirely up to states whether or not they want to follow daylight saving time. And so states like Arizona and Hawaii actually don't follow daylight saving time. Who knows, maybe one day all of the states around the United States won't follow daylight saving time. It is becoming a little bit less useful because we really don't run on coal too much anymore and we really don't save as much energy anymore with daylight saving time.